What's good, sneaker fam? Welcome back to our sneakers. Today, we are going to talk about these masks, as you guys saw in the title. Do me a favor and actually watch the whole thing because I do have a lot to say, and I feel like it's something that you guys want to listen to, especially if you guys are interested in these things. So to start off, I'm going to show you guys exactly what you guys clicked on the video for, and it is this mask right here. As you can see, I did customize one of the masks. I did make a second one, and I drew a bait mouth on one of them, as you guys can see right here. And honestly, I feel like I did a really good job. It could have been better, but... For the most part, for this being my first painting custom like this on a mask, it, I think it's pretty good. Um, and this is what it looks like on the face. I think it's super sick because, I mean, it's vape and then it's Yeezy. It's like a Yeezy vape collab, but not authentically. It's just paint, like drawn on. It's a custom. So I did just draw it on. And honestly, this is a mask I would be using for like Ultra next week. Or is it this weekend? Whatever weekend it is, I think it's this weekend. And also, I will be using this to any EDM kind of festival. Also, if I ever go up north, I will be using this in the cold because it does get freaking cold out there, especially in New York around the winter time or anywhere up there. And in Peru this summer when I go, which is actually going to be winter, I'm going to use it there too. Because like I said, when it gets cold in the winter in these places, it gets really freaking cold. Anyways, a lot of you guys have been asking, can I buy that from you? I want to buy it. If you made more, I would buy it. So I, as of now, I only have these two made, but this is my personal one. I'm definitely not selling this at all but I will be selling this one right here. And this is actually the more properly stitched one. It's the one that people like the most because this one right here, it is kind of raggedy stitched. So I don't mind keeping that. And plus I already do the mouth on it, which is super sick. I love it. And I'm just gonna keep that for my personal use. Like I already said, I think I just spit a little. So instead of actually selling this to just one of you, since I don't know who would wanna buy it, I will be raffling it off to make it fair. That being said, every raffle ticket is gonna cost $10 each. I will have the raffle tickets up for sale on my website, so you can go find that in the link down in the description below. I would have made this like a bidding auction, but unfortunately, I just, I feel like it should be fair for everybody to have a chance to get this mask. So I was like, might as well just raffle it. And I'm not gonna give it away because it did take me time to do this. It actually is a lot more time consuming than you think. There will be a total of 100 spots. So for every ticket you buy, you do have a 1% chance of winning which seems low, but it's kind of like a key master. Like whenever you put $5 in or $10 in, whatever key master costs, you're really, you have a really low chance because first of all, the machines have to reach their minimum and then they give you the prize. That's basically kind of how they work, if you didn't know. Once all 100 raffle tickets are taken, I will make another video announcing the winner and they will be contacted and it will be shipped to them with free shipping. So they don't have to worry about shipping. All you gotta do is put in the raffle ticket and leave the rest to me. Also, I did wanna say that I'm making a mask out of the zebras. And the way I'm doing this is I will be actually bidding the first one off and then the second mask, I don't know, but I'm not gonna make it yet because I'm gonna let you guys bid. So if you guys are serious about bidding on the mask, please email me. My email is randy underscore ugaldi at hotmail.com. You can find that in the description down below. It does say for business inquirers only. So go ahead and email me at that email and offer up your bids. And the highest bid will take a mask except they get to choose which side they want. So remember the right shoe is gonna have the SPLY on the right side and then the left shoe of course is gonna have it on the left side. I'm gonna let you guys know as of now that the highest bid for the Zebras is 150. And no, I'm not just saying that to start the mask off at 150, somebody actually asked to pay 150 for them. So if you're gonna make an offer, make sure it's over 150. One more thing I do wanna say before I sign out, I wanna give a big thank you to all 9,000 and whatever number of you guys are subscribed. I don't know the exact number right now, but out of nowhere we hit 9K pretty quick in like a week which is crazy thank you guys so much we're about to hit 10k and you know that's the goal and when we do i am giving away a pair of yeezys well that's when i'll be starting the yeezy giveaway and also just subscribe because i will be doing a lot more giveaways i got a few things coming from other companies and i'm ready to give stuff away pretty soon maybe at 10k 15k whatever the number is i will be giving a lot of stuff away in the near future so stay tuned to the channel and subscribe before i go i do want to give a shout out to the fan of the day and today's fan of the day is laser c4 he actually commented on my last video. He's like, LOL, Foot Locker receipt for zebras. If someone gets caught with that, then they deserve it. Well, it's funny because when I was reviewing the shoe, I didn't even realize that it was a, I mean, I realized it was a Foot Locker receipt, but I didn't realize that Foot Locker didn't even sell the zebras. The zebras were extremely limited to just Adidas and Adidas only. Anyways, if you did enjoy the video, make sure to give it a thumbs up. Also, don't forget to subscribe. Like I said, we are trying to get to 10,000 subscribers by my birthday, which I'm pretty sure will happen pretty soon because the way you guys are showing love to the channel is going pretty good. So thank you guys so much. Make sure you stay woke. Our sneakers signing out. Alcatraz. Peace.